<laughs> so you're going home, obviously. I mean, just talk about the trip and maybe what it'll mean to you to see to play in front of friends and family as a member of Kentucky. Uh, it'll mean a lot. Uh, just to um, had a chance to play in front of my mom and my grandma. And, uh, just show them me as a college player and how much I've improved since high school, and um, just to prove how much harder I play. How much? Have, how much have you improved, Terrence? Um, I'd say I proved a lot on my shot uh, and just playing harder. Coach said he talked to you about this trip, about going to Portland. What what message did he think he wanted to get across to you? Um, pretty much just to stay focused on the game and not worried about the little things like who's in the crowd and um, just playing different because I'm playing in front of people I know. Have you been, have you been homesick? Nah, you got nah. Um, hanging with uh, Ron and Brandon, I've just been having fun here. How many people will you have there? How many tickets? I don't know. A lot, though. <laughs> <laughs> have you played Seven in the Rose Garden six. before? Yeah, I played in it um, twice with my high school team and then once with Nike Hoops. Hoops up. Being Curtis. from Portland, knowing, you know, the pilots. Can you kind of warn you know your teammates? Hey, this is a pretty good team. We're gonna have to come to play to beat them. Yeah, uh, Coach Cal pretty much has explained that in the practices and um, told us um, not to take it lightly. And um, I know that, but I think all the players get that too. How good are they, Terrence? Uh, well, I haven't seen them this year, but um, most of the games I went to to see, usually the other team they usually won, so they're pretty good. You worried you might get booed though? Hmm? You worried you might get booed at all? No. <laughs> <laughs> Coach said that you mapped out your uh, what you're going to do almost minute by minute, and he hoped you fit the game in at 7:30. What, what exactly have you put on your schedule that you're going to be doing besides the game? Um, I'm going back to. Uh, well, me and him are going back to a place I grew up going to, and. Uh, just seeing my family, I don't really have that much plan. He's just That's saying that. <laughs> Cal being Cal, you're used to yeah. that already. Terrence, you talk about like how much you like how hard he is mm -hmm. on you because it makes you a better player. A lot of players, you know, can't can't handle that. Why do you like it so much? Um, just because I don't look at it the wrong way. I don't look at it as he's yelling at me because he's mad. Um, I just look at it as him. He's wanting me to do better, to better the team, and because he expects it. That's what I like. He said he told you that uh, when a guy goes home and plays from him, doesn't play very well. Mm -hmm. Did it bother you at all, or is it a challenge? Yeah, or not? Right. Um, nah. Uh, hopefully I prove him wrong. Uh, but, no, nah, I just really want to play and show them the whole team. Uh, not just me. Just me playing with um, a new team, new faces, and show how well we are as a team. Terrence, this is only your second varsity game, and you talk about how much you've improved your, your game since you left Portland. Talk about how you would explain that to the people back home why you're so much better. Um, what have you been up to? I'd say just how much I play more than what I did in Portland and working out with coaches at night uh, for practice, um, just putting in the extra work. How was 